We're here at Epic Snack Shack. Oh my gosh, I look like a dork. This episode is brought to you by snacks, but if you've seen any of my mundane vlogs, it'll be a little taste of everything. I wish this thing was on. Yeah, I wish that thing was on too. It's fun. <laughs> I zoomed way in. I was pretty overwhelmed when I first came in here. Give the video a thumbs up. Oh my gosh. Make sure to give this video a like. <laughs> Nine minutes left on this tape. Sour skittle. Oh my gosh. There's also a pretty can um, case around the corner. This is a very famous soda in, I forgot where, Scotland, I think. The pretty can section and oh, bottles. Nice. I bought this one. Boom, boom. Look at that. Two. Give the video another thumbs up. <laughs> What is this? All of this, you may ask. My mom's friend Jackie just uh, visited her family in Japan and brought with her four boxes worth of fun little gifts. One of my favorite things to do when I travel, especially overseas, is go to grocery stores. I'm not super interested in big landmarks or like tourist attractions. I kind of just like grocery stores. The mundane, the everyday, blah, blah, blah. You know me. A lot of this is just kind of like fun little everyday things. First up, we're gonna try these. Sake Kit Kat review. Okay, I'm really zoomed in. Okay. That's the ASMR. ASMR. I'm trying to not. Hey, stop stealing my jokes while I say <laughs> Oh, I can smell it. Oh, wow, it does smell like sake. I've drank a lot of sake in my life. Broke it. Nice, like I got it. Oh. That tastes exactly like sake. No, Simon. It tastes like Nagori sake if you've ever had that. It's really good. I also have a pretty can of the day that I already drank. Look at Simon with the... Look at the sweet, sweet Guinness. The color gradient. I could write a poem about it. Here we are, another day, another dollar. Fit check. <laughs> Where'd you go? Me? I look like shit right now. It's I completely blurred out. <laughs> oh, it's blurred out? <laughs> now it isn't. Maybe I shouldn't be showing the inside of my cabinets. Yeah, like a little one here. I can't see. Thomas J can't see without his glasses. <laughs> Where are his glasses? <laughs> is working on another composition. Would you like to tell us what you're working on? It's a musical it, intro for a improv show that's improvised uh, like old radio shows from like the nice. 30s and 40s. I just don't, I don't know why I can't see. Okay, there we go. Hire him for your compositions. <laughs> oh, Iron Brew. <gasps> Jackie brought back Kit Kat from Japan. And there's some here too. It, but they don't have the sake ones. And look, funny mix. Funny mix? That's my kind of mix. These are so good. What yeah. makes it funny? I don't know. I got the sour one and it was amazing. <laughs> oh, pretty. What about Lipsy Pop? Oh, that's cute. You want one? Oh Ooh, my gosh, look at this. This is so cute. Vote which one. The oh, Solcon XC? It'll be done by the time. Or the Mix Fizz. I've never tried this chocolate. Have you ever tried it? Probably a lot. No. Oh, nice. 
the Mr. Bite. Oh, that's cute. Now I'm like, I'm sure. I'm gonna get the menu. I have chicken noodle soup. I would eat chicken noodle soup. You gotta wait for Billiam. It's so muted, it doesn't matter. It's on your mini DD camera. This is gonna work. Pittsfield. Whoa, it <laughs> smells like murder. I love that the moment I started filming this, the sun decided to go away. Do I film on a sunnier day? Is that what I do? Refilm this whole thing on a sunnier day? I don't think so. I want to keep it as real as possible and you can experience the darkness with me. Thank you to Jackie who shared her uh, trip to Japan with us. I'll have to do like some sort of a montage. I'm super excited about the stickers. I love stickers. This episode is going to be all over the place. I'm still figuring this out, right? It's one of those hot days where the sun's going away and it's still hot and a storm's probably going to come. It's not very nice. Also not great for allergies, which I don't know if that's what's causing. The bangs are covering up some serious skin issues, which I can't get answers for. And does anyone have answers f of, for any th problem they have? <laughs> Not really, right? You're a tiger, you're the noise. They say they hate you. Samanko. Where's Shah? Oh, that looks good. Here's Sh Shahi Kusi. I'm experiencing some nausea, so we have a Pepto Bismol. The prettiest snack of all. She likes the color. Apparently, this is vloggable. Hey, <laughs> okay, how much are you supposed to fill it up? Okay, this is. Uh, yeah. Oh, well, I guess it's um, knockoff brand. This is the famous and attack. Just a light snack. <laughs> Does Flawful have protein? Do we know that? It's made with chickpeas, I think. I believe so. I would so. assume. My YouTube commenters will <laughs> give their hot Ask you too. <laughs> 
I'm gonna look up if these have protein. I've never seen Hunger Games, and Nora thinks I should see it. In this political climate, it's it's happening in real life. I think she should watch it. But I don't really only like comedies. But I guess that speaks to my tone deafness. No. Okay. It's Do falafels have protein? Two point three grams. So like half an egg. It doesn't pick it up very well. We always need a sweet treat after we eat. Yeah. If these were chocolate covered, I'd be all over them. Ooh. Do they have chocolate covered orange peels? Because if they do... You're yeah. really into this chocolate covered orange stuff, are you? Aren't ya? Yes, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I got this at the Epic Snack Shop. Mm. Oh, you know what? Maybe I should buy some dark chocolate. We do have ice cream at home, I think we can steal. Raspberry white chocolate. Hmm. world would I eat a meal like this if I could be chowing down on pop and candy? Oh, never mind. That was cookies and cream noodles. The crackers. Yes. Ketchup chips. You ever had them? Yes. From Canada, have, they're so good. I have had those before. They were. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Lays. I've never seen those. Wafer style. Oh look, Uncle Chips. There's also Master. Master Chips. Uncle Chips I love. Uncle Chips. Oh, I know what you're talking about. You know the little triangle cheese? Yeah, it's that flavor of chip. Here's Mr. Chips. I've <laughs> tried this one before. Pizza Hut Lay's. This episode wasn't quite a snack, was it? More of a meal. Or a soup or a sandwich, I'd say. The things we love, the little treats in life that bring us joy, begin to define a small part of us. This is how you make a, a vlog about snacks meaningful and profound. Hear me out. I'll leave you with a quote from Harriet the Spy when her mother says, Harriet, you've been bringing a tomato and mayonnaise sandwich to school every day for the last five years. Don't you want a little variety? To which she responds, I can't help it if I know what I like and I know that I like tomato. May we all carry that confidence with us in our snack eating, in our everyday experiences. Peace out. I'll see you next time, hopefully more often, once a week maybe. You'll see. Okay, bye. Never tried this before, Iron Brew. Ooh, it tastes like, it tastes like cream soda, it's really good. Nice.